I'm not happy about this. No, I, I can't expect you to be on. Yeah, stop saying you're sorry. All right, all right, fine. We got a job to do. We gotta go loot some security cameras for the greater good. For the greater good. For the greater good. Ah. Uh. You know, it'd be nice when I can when I can get my revenge on those things out there. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. This this has given you a whole new opportunities for revenge that ordinary people couldn't even think of. Uh, they're not. They're not human. I don't. I couldn't even begin to tell you what they are. Go away, Raven. Go away. No, no. Give it some breadcrumbs. Then the Ravens will be your friends. That Those are not breadcrumbs. I didn't even flinch. Well, remember, it only... It, it only kills what you want it to kill. But I thought it would at least startle it. I mean, that Raven seen some shit. Josiah, this is the one that needs to change it. Have it done before I'm back from Bangor. New cameras are in the basement. Remember to fill out the repair form and file with museum admins. What What do you think people in Maine sound like? I don't know. Well, you're in Maine. You've talked to people here. I just figure rednecks sound the same wherever. I figure anybody named Josiah would sound the same regardless. What do you think the Bible sounds like? That. Oh, wait, I'm looking in your... You're from North Carolina? It's in your dossier? Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. <sighs> oh, serious? They have a crate of security cameras? Who, who gets security cameras by the crate load? There's a... There's somebody down here. T oh, um... Huh. Oh, my... He's got the blue thingy. Yeah, that's something I was doing. But, oh! I think you should go away. You should go away now. You need to go away because I'm not feeling very stable right now. You got, you got a little thing on you. Um, on your... Oh, man. On your everything. Somebody dumped a big vat of Todd McFarlane over him. What the fuck? Debbie? Is That's C4. That is C4, yes. I'm thinking I should avoid these lasers. That's generally a good idea. Is he... Is he controlling the lasers with magic, or... Which is really good motion I sensors. Just... I don't know. I think he's just standing there and waving wobbling. Go back. Oh my god, look at, look at how much pain he is in. It's just... Uh, this seems... Oh god, this seems to be burrowing into his brain or something. And, uh, oh yeah, there's the motion sensors. I just figure that... Yeah, yeah I figure the motion sensors are probably tied to C4. Uh, just, just seems like something would be... Uh, yeah, but... Yeah, I was hoping you might know what, what, the, what the hell that thing was. I... I was hoping you'd know. How would I know? I don't... Okay, yeah, I mean, that's a good point. Uh, uh-oh. Huh, that's ominous. I don't know what that means. Aw, oh, crap, did not think that through. Oh, shit. What just happened? I think you got exploded. But no, nothing's exploded. I just didn't appear back here. Did did did? 
could be another time anomaly. Okay. That's weird. I mean, because I think if I exploded, there would be exploded things. I think when you come back... Oh, yes, exploded things. Yeah, never mind. I mean, Debbie, I gotta complain with you. you know, I, I work in the I work in the basement of a call center. Run, you know, I I'm not exactly privy to a lot of classified information on how time shenanigans work. Shit! That was not smart. No. Ooh. Okay, third time's a charm, eh, Deb? You know, that actually really hurts for like a split second. Really? Yeah! Huh. Being blown up hurts. Imagine that. I mean, I would have thought it was just like instant. Well, like, imagine how much pain you can possibly feel in, in an instant. Okay, you are making a salient point. I'm glad I didn't really trap this one. I mean, that's what I would have done. Oh, man, yeah. Well, I mean, he's got tentacles growing out of his head. He's probably... Whoa! Oh, shit. What the hell is that? Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. God. It burns. It oh, burns. Shit. It burns. Oh, shit. That's the filth. Got to... Get it off you somehow. It, it's, it, uh, okay, it's gone. Huh. Ow. I heal fast, don't I? Yeah, but you don't seem to like the fill. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> don't seem to like you. Let's just get out of here. What the hell is that all about? Seriously, who keeps a crate of these things? Why, and who guards them with bombs? I wonder if he set them up to, like, keep people out? Or to keep himself in? Because, you know, the way that was set up, he couldn't disarm it from his side. It's true, but I mean, you think... You think, though, he would have locked himself in and not... Um... What month is it? It is the current month. No, it's August. Well, nearly September. A little early for the Halloween decorations, eh? Or very late. Well, I mean, like, if this had been... If this went up in October, it'd be all mushy. It'd be, it wouldn't even be mush by now. No, it would just be... Wouldn't it just be like... Microscopic CSI pumpkin residue. Yeah. Do you know Halloween starts earlier every year? I mean, you ever, you ever go on the Tumblr? Yeah, I know. I love Halloween. It's my favorite holiday, of course. Because I'm a stereotype. But. This is not normal. What if I didn't. See so if you can find a newspaper. Maybe get the date from that. Oh wait, no. Who are the, nobody, nobody reads newspapers. Yeah, this definitely seems like they're. Also, didn't it get dark fast? Oh my god! Yeah, it went from noon to midnight, and like. Half an hour. We're definitely dealing with some time oddities here, aren't we? This is really odd. We gotta, gotta make sure to put this in your reports. Yeah. Wait, who are these guys, and what are they doing here? Oh, yeah. We call them the Council of Venice, but mostly we call them the Smurfs. They're basically the the secret society version of the United Nations. What are they doing here? 
I'm fuck all. Just like the real thing. Our wisdom flows so sweet, taste and see. Transmit, initiate the assembly signal. Receive, initiate the lame behemoth syntax. Deadlock voting remains unbroken. Initiate the Armageddon proclamation. Sound and fury signifying nothing. Initiate the Technicolor Spectrum. Witness the Council of Venice. All right, now let's boot the let's boot the sucker up and see what, see what we got. Nice. Ah. <laughs> uh -huh. Really good shot. Good news! Data from your surveillance system is now feeding into our server. This means we have visual contact with the enemy and can make more detailed assessments of the situation. It also means I can keep tabs on you. The janitor in the basement showed signs of a strange tentacular mutation. Disgusting, frankly. It's not clear if, the, if he booby-trapped the surroundings to protect himself or to try and protect others. Regardless, if it was it was clever, and that's not something we like to see from our enemies. Keep me posted on the on all technical related phenomena. KG. Of course, I'm sure she would be interested in that. She has an aquarium. Shit goes down. I see. She gets weird. Deputy Andy, I brought the ammo to a little earlier. He seems like a nice boy. Yeah, he seems pretty straight-laced. I wanted to be a police officer since as far back as I can think. I had a lot of time to myself growing up. Yeah. I watched all the cop shows, again and again. The old shows. When a good cop was always a good cop. When you knew you could trust a badge, right? You knew before the half hour was up they'd get the guy. Out of the basement. Oddly specific. So that was my goal. Plain and simple. I was single-minded about it. You, you ask anyone, and they'll say, Hey, yeah, that Andy, he sure is single-minded. Cut to somebody saying, That Andy sure is single-minded. Now, I wasn't what you'd call a, a straight-A student, but I got there. I got there. And when Sheriff Bannerman swore me on as deputy, gave me my badge, <laughs> I'd been up all night eyeing in this shirt. It, it was crisper than you'd believe. Well, that day I was just as happy as a clam at high tide. Jeez, you never saw anything like this in the cop shows. Well, maybe on cable, not the network ones. You wouldn't know it from looking out there, but before that wicked bad fog rolled in, Kingsmith was a sleepy little burg. Nothing stronger on the streets than a hot cup of coffee and chocolate glazed donuts from Susie's. The occasional DUI or domestic disturbance. Human sacrifice. Wait, 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 what? But every town has a dark side, right? We sure are getting a heap help in the darkness now, eh? The walking dead and worse besides taking over our town. Our survivors hold up in here, hoping it's all just a bad dream and we'll wake up to the smell of bacon and maple syrup. But unless someone ups and does something, and soon, all we're gonna wake up to is the smell of rotten flesh. And I don't need another thing to remind me of my dad. What? Halloween does bring back the memories, eh? Wait, wait, okay. I have numerous questions that I do not think you're going to answer. I think it's best just to slowly walk yeah, away, no sudden movements, and jump straight off the building. That's a... Holy shit, Andy has... I mean, Andy has some layers to him. He has some... That's, uh... Andy's father sounds like a real piece of work. Real character, as people would say. Yeah, that's one way to put it. Oh, 
I wonder where these zombies are coming from. They seem to be, uh, they seem to be trying to attack this place. You gotta get to the north barricades before they do. Maybe they can smell living humans. Maybe. Jeez. Oh, shit. This isn't just a random attack. This is a raid. They're coordinating. I mean, as much as zombies can. We got some more trouble on the south barricade. Now they're attacking from a different direction. Okay, this is coordinated. I'm trying to exhaust this. It's the spread too thin. Coming in from the south side now. Yes, but these are zombies. Well, no, I'm, I know, I'm saying it's I know, no, I'm not doubting, I'm not yes. doubting it, I'm yeah. just saying, yeah, yeah, I'm saying this is, I don't think they're planning this. Ah, you mean something must be controlling them. Yeah, like those things down by the docks. Oh, that would just be perfect, wouldn't it? All the monsters would just be teaming up together. Why not? Looks as though we got the situation under control for now. Okay, let's let's see where these guys came from. What makes you think they came from this way? That. That's a good, strong evidence there. And, um, that's oh my a big God. thing. That thing. It's the size of a taco truck. Oh my god, look at it. It has two heads, it, see that? It has a chest vagina. Oh, and a chest vagina. Oh god. Yeah, look at that. It's two heads. Oh my god, it's like. Like a squid head and a. It's like the human's just trapped inside of it, trying to push its way out. This is interesting. We have no records of direct contact with the drogs, so your sightings in Kingsmouth catches us a little off guard. Other factions have encountered them frequently at sea. Of course, file sharing isn't a common practice in the industry. Here's what we know. The drog are an ancient and marine variety of undead with roots in Norse mythology. They seem to be directing local attacks. As for everything we don't know, well, that's where you come in. Ciao, ciao. Well, I mean, wow. Yeah, the drog, huh? Holy shit. The Skyrim all over again. Oh, yeah. So there they were also zombies. Here, I don't even know what they are. Well, they seem to be some variety of undead. They certainly look dead. I don't know. That that chest vagina looked awfully alive. Only I can say that. Sorry. It's just weird when you talk about it. Yeah, I... 
I was kind of going from there, but I think I did go a little too far into that. I got, yeah. Man, it's amazing I can jump like that. I know, right? You're like some kind of video game character. Almost, yeah. You should totally try to kill a zombie by stomping on it. I, I, I'm pretty sure that won't work. No, come on. Do the Mario. Swing your arms from side. No. No. Yeah, I just realized that both Lou Albano and Bob Hoskins are dead. We've lost two out of three Marios. Who's the third? The Charles Martinet, who does, like, the voice in the games. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, God, I knew that name without having to look it up. What have I done with my life? Uh, probably more than I have. Says the secret agent fighting zombies. Well, okay, that was... Well, okay, up until this point. Fair enough.